Hello village, what's village here and welcome to a new episode of Let's Talk Minecraft Let's Play And as you can hear, I'm very tired because I just had the most strange awakening ever <laughs> And I just want to talk to you guys about this because this is so goddamn ugly, I can't stress this enough I... I woke up with a very strange feeling tonight because... Uh, this morning, because when I woke up, my whole face was covered in blood my whole, like, I didn't know before, like, you know when you take your tongue and you take it around your mouth just because you can feel some licorice, like some aqua, something like that, some water on your, on your mouth. I didn't know what it is and probably it was just some snot, so I took my tongue, took it around, and it was fucking blood. When I go, went up, because I live in the basement, when I then went up to check my face to see what the fuck, what the fuck had happened, <laughs> my whole face was covered in blood, my nose, I couldn't see it for blood, it was so, like... <laughs> I was almost like, ah! <laughs> oh, I'm so, like, I was so glad that my parents were at home because it was not like, it wasn't embarrassing. It was just so fucking awkward. Like, what? What have I like tickled my nose? Uh, what? <laughs> it was so fucking gay. I have to admit that it was like when I woke up. I first thought, what? What have I been done? What have I been doing? And is this right even? Yeah, it is. Oh my god. And as you can see, I'm starting to build the pineapple tree. And I, I got kind of bored of the other two projects that I have got going on at the moment. So I decided to do this just for like a new episode. Oh, like. To do this for an episode so you guys could see what I'm doing. Like, so I, I need to have some diversity in my videos. So, oh, I'm always talking, but I need some different gameplays because that slime finder. I don't know if it's working yet, to be honest. Uh, one, two. Yep. I don't know if it's working yet because when I go, when I, when I leave it, no slime spawns. So I just have to check if it actually works because then I used a lot of effort into building something that doesn't work. So that's gonna be bad. <laughs> and I think it was Fiasco here who uh, typed in Skype. Oh, do you really play survival? Because you got so many things. And I don't. I he didn't. Th he didn't type. I don't think you're you're cheating, but. I could like see it in the way he wrote, and I, I wrote back. Yes, I'm playing on survival. I, I think the creative is taking a bit out of the fun of Minecraft. So I just, so I'm playing on survival, and I can understand to a point where he thinks I'm cheating because I got so much of everything, and that's because I was sick in the first two episodes. If you remember, I was sick in the two first episodes, and that means that I stayed home from school. So I had around 12 hours of doing nothing, and when I do nothing, I help you guys. And I think I'm gonna turn up the sound and I forgot that again. Oh, and I'm also playing on peaceful. What the fuck? You didn't see that. You didn't see it. You didn't see it. Like, I don't really pl I don't like playing against monsters. <laughs> I don't know why, but I really don't. And the sound is too high. But, yeah, I don't really like playing against mon monsters. I don't think it's... I don't think it's that fun. So, when, when I'm not recording, I don't play on... on uh, except if I'm building a mob spawn or going to caves or at night. But in the days, I don't really want monsters because it's supposed to be in the daytime. There are supposed to be no monsters. But what the fuck? There's so many monsters. There's spiders, there's creepers, there's everything. And I don't really like that because I'm getting fucked over all the time. Like, each time I die, I just go like, oh, I'm, I'm, I don't want to play Minecraft anymore. And I don't want to get that feeling because then there's going to be no videos for you guys. And I have, I have seen that I've been growing in subscribers a lot lately. And I really thank you guys pretty much for that but on with another topic because this is let's talk and play and I don't really want to talk about Minecraft that much when I have other topics to talk about so the next topic that I really want to talk about is Zambia beating Cote d'Ira oh how do you want to say that <laughs> and Danish is called the Elfen Bing Kirsten so yep I don't know how to say that in English actually but the Cote d'Ira I think it's called they got beat the guys with drug by Samuel Kalu and Choo -choo, or what is called the guy from Newcastle. They got beaten by Zambia in the final on penalties. And Didier Jok by Mr. Pe Mr. Penalty in the 70 minute. Didier Jok back could have sealed the game for Cote Ira, But what did he do? He totally screwed up. It's such a shame that he actually do did that. Because if you just think of how much effort they put into that. How much like Chelsea could have used Jok back instead of Fernando Torres. Who doesn't score any goals in in the BPL, they could have used Taurus, uh, in the, they could have used Drogba, and now that Drogba is coming back with only silver, it's gonna be kind of disappointing because 
they actually lost some uh, some places because of the loss of the Dietrich Bass. So I would have been kind of irritated if I was the if I was Andrew Villabors from Chelsea, but. I don't think he could be annoyed because it's like the national duty. You can't really fuck with national duties. Yeah, strange. But now that Zambia has beaten Cote d'Ivoire, I think they need to be in FIFA 13. Like, I'm I have Twitter, Twitter, and I don't really type on Twitter, but I follow guys on Twitter just to see what they type. And this looks neat. But I follow what, to see what they what they type. And KSI said, "Oh, yep. Now they're beating Cote d'Ivoire. Isn't it time that they get in the FIFA for, in FIFA?" The Zambia is not even in FIFA 13 or so, uh, FIFA 12. It's kind of gay how they're not in the game and they just beat the best African team <laughs> that I know of. So that's really awkward, to be honest. Oh, I want to go inside, won't I? I need to go inside, not outside. What am I doing? Then here. Yep. Oh, kind of like spikes. Kind of more like spikes. Sun and it's gone. Yeah, but Zambia, I don't know one player. I can't name one player. I didn't even watch the game. I followed on like a radio broadcast, and it sounds really gay saying it now. But I followed on a radio broadcast, and oh my god, and it sounded so dramatic in the end. It was like, oh, they have a chance. No, it's the other way. Now they have a chance. Now it's the other way. Now they have a chance. And it went like that the last 30 minutes, and it was so like, oh. Oh, now that, no, 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 <laughs> I was like, what the fuck is happening, it's the fucking final, and it's exciting, and I can't watch it, because my internet was fucked up, so, that's also part of the reason that there was no video yesterday, my internet fucked up, like, we couldn't post anything, or post, we couldn't do anything, and it was so goddamn annoying, like, I want to get a video, because I've got holiday, and I have, like, I have the means now to do a video each day, and you know what? My internet said, no, you're not on a holiday. You are in jail. Du, du, du. <laughs> a bit overdramatic, possibly, but who cares? Oh, another topic I want to talk to you guys about is YouTube diversity. Like, when I, the guys that I follow on YouTube, it's range a lot. Like, I follow 75,000 for his FIFA. I follow Chugga Conroy for his Pokemon. It's so, like, I follow guys from every single like direction of YouTube is kind of awkward I follow League of Legends guys I follow what do I follow I can't really think of anyone else I'm following I'm following Swifty for his World of Warcraft even though I don't play World of Warcraft I just like the way that he is like <laughs> I'm strange at that point so I don't know but I want to know guys which guys do you follow like how big is your diversity I know you follow me and that's either for Minecraft or for my personality I'm not sure but, oh, yeah, pro cycle manager, I don't know. But still, <laughs> I want to know what you guys, like, what your range of, of, like, the guys that you're subscribed to are. Because my range is so goddamn big. I don't know, ex I don't know how I found everyone. Like, one month I'm to Call of Duty, and ne the next month I'm to FIFA instead. But, oh, and that's not, that's not actually true, because I'm always to FIFA. FIFA is probably the game that I spent a lot of hours into. Like, the most hours ever into it. And it's just, FIFA is a game that's... That I never really find boring because it's always a new outcome. You can always be some player, try new teams, all that. FIFA is just one game that is exciting and fresh. And when FIFA Street comes out, I'm definitely going to be buying that game because I like skilling and I think skilling is fun. And FIFA 13 just, it looks amazing. Like, I think it was FIFA 1 that I played a lot, no, FIFA 2 that I played a lot of with my friends. Like, <laughs> In FIFA, t in FIFA Street 2, you could just press the, f the square button and you could never catch the ball. Like, it would be locked in the air constantly. It was just so freaking fun how the, how the mechanics of this game work. But, nevertheless, we had a lot of fun and that's what counts. So, that is really ga great. And I'm actually coming to an end now, guys. Should we just take a look at how this is looking? Oh, if I can oh I don't want to die now. Not with a lot of levels. Uh. No, we can't get down. That's no one. But this is how the inside looking at the moment. It looks really neat. Thanks for watching, guys. See you in the next episode. No, I forgot to say. If you follow to this point, type in the comment section YouTube. Y O U T U B E. YouTube. Type that in the comment section. See you guys later for real.